Hi, this is Graeme here. I just want to give a quick introduction on how to use ChemDraw. So the first thing I like to do in ChemDraw is actually just make the page a little bit bigger. So to do this, we just go down to Document Settings, and we can increase the page size to 3 by 3 Okay, so three pages will open. And then I also like to have the crosshairs in and also to show some rulers as well. This kind of helps with making things nice and neat while drawing. Okay, so just in general, so on the left hand side here I have a toolbar open. Um, if your toolbar isn't appearing, you can go to view and you can show main toolbar. And there's various different toolbars along here as well, which can also help you. So just to get started, I suppose, just to talk around the toolbar. So we start at the bottom. We can see there's different templates you can use. So you can open up a benzene ring, for example, which would be quite helpful. And then if you want to start sticking bonds off the benzene ring, you can do that as well. So this line bond um, is defaulted to a carbon-carbon bond. So we can draw the carbon-carbon bond in here. We can just keep on drawing them by clicking the carbon-carbon bond. Um, if you make a mistake and you want to draw on one of the bonds, you can use an eraser. Okay, so if you wanted to label a different atom in other than a carbon, um, you can do this by using a text box. So once make sure your keyboard is in capitals, and when just at the end of the bond, when it goes blue, if you click on the end of the bond, a text box will appear. So if a text box appears, you can put in, say, OH for an alcohol group. Okay, so the square, the square button highlights everything on the page. So, or you can highlight your different molecules on the page, or if you want to highlight just a section of the molecule as well, you can use the square or just as easy use the lasso. Okay. So um, if you wanted to put maybe some different stereochemistry on, so if you want to, oh, sorry, just delete that. Um, if you want to put on some stereochemistry, so again, with the end of the bond going blue, click down and you can create your bond. Um, so you can use the other type of stereochemistry going away from the plane. And you can draw whatever molecule you wish.